28 Silliam Terrier Facts Every Owner Should Know Number 1. Courageous and Spirited The Silliam Terrier, affectionately known as a Silly, is a small to medium-sized breed, standing at 10 to 11 inches at the shoulder. For males, the recommended weight ranges between 23 and 24 pounds, while females tend to be slightly lighter. Number 2. These dogs are easily recognizable by their distinct head, showcasing a strong, slightly rounded skull. Their eyes are dark, round and expressive, reflecting a keen and alert demeanor. And the charming beard and mustache further contribute to the breed's unique and delightful look. Number 3. The charm of these terriers lies in their small, rounded tipped ears, elegantly placed high on the head. These ears fold over, framing the face and extending to the outer corner of the eye. They are thin, not leathery, and possess enough thickness to prevent creases. Number 4. These little dogs have two layers of fur, a soft, thick layer underneath and a tough, weather-resistant layer on top. Their coat is typically white, though some might sport tan, lemon or badger markings around the head and ears. Number 5. The tail of a Sealy is high, upright and typically trimmed to a medium length. Positioned forward to prevent a sloping spine, the tail plays a vital role in achieving a well-balanced look for the dog. Number 6. According to Stanley Korn's book, The Intelligence of Dogs, Siliam Terriers are considered to have fair working intelligence, ranking 56th out of 79 dog breed groups. They usually learn new commands after 40 to 80 repetitions, and they obey the first command 30% of the time. Number 7. While these small dogs are quite smart, they can exhibit occasional stubbornness, a typical trait among terriers. Their independence and determination often translate into strong-willed demeanor. However, with early training and consistent guidance, you can easily redirect their determined nature into positive behavior. Number 8. Do not underestimate the Siliam Terrier because they are small size. Sealies are excellent watchdogs thanks to their alertness and protective nature. They'll bark to alert you if something seems amiss and they will make every effort to protect their loved ones in a dangerous situation. Number 9. Similar to many terriers, this dog breed may act out if they're bored or if they're lacking stimulation. Insufficient attention, exercise or mental engagement will make them chew, dig or engage in all sorts of destructive activities for entertainment. So to prevent chaos at home, ensure your Sealy receives adequate physical and mental stimulation. Number 10. With a history in hunting small vermin, like rats and rabbits, this breed naturally possesses a high prey drive. As a result, there is an increased likelihood of them showing interest in chasing cats, other small animals, and even children within the home. To prevent any potential mishaps, ensure that they are leashed when outside. Number 11. Sealies are known for their inquisitive and adventurous disposition, often leading them to explore or attempt to escape. Their inherent curiosity and abundant energy might motivate them to wander, if not adequately stimulated or exercised. To prevent any escapades, ensure the fence is securely in place and they receive sufficient exercise. Number 12. A generally healthy breed, the Siliam Terrier typically has an average life expectancy of 12 to 14 years. With proper care and affection, many of these dogs can live even longer and more fulfilling lives. Number 13. While typically robust, the Sealy, like any other breed, may be susceptible to certain conditions. This may include lens luxation, eye issues, allergies, deafness, and idiopathic epilepsy. Number 14. Some Sealy Ams may also be prone to intervertebral disc disease, a condition characterized by the degeneration of discs between the vertebrae, resulting in discomfort in the back, neck, legs, and arms. In severe cases, surgery might be required, while less serious instances may benefit from medications and weight management. Number 15. Sealies can also be susceptible to retinal dysplasia, a congenital abnormality affecting the retina. While most cases are mild and don't lead to significant vision loss, Sealies diagnosed with retinal dysplasia should not be bred. Number 16. One other condition potential owners need to be wary of in Siliam Terriers is degenerative myelopathy. This ailment weakens their back legs and may advance to complete paralysis and incontinence. While there is no specific cure, many dogs can be supported to let them have a good quality life for months to years. Number 17. The Siliam Terrier had its beginnings in the mid-1800s when Captain John Edwards initiated the breeding process on the Siliam estate. His objective was to produce a petite white dog with a robust jaw and a wiry coat, specifically tailored for hunting, small game, and managing pest populations, particularly badgers. Number 18. It is said that Edwards might have combined different breeds like the Bull Terrier, the West Highland White Terrier, and maybe even the Dandy Denman Terrier and the Pembroke Welsh Corgi to form 
the silly ham. However, there are no official records confirming the breed's ancestry. Number 19. After Edwards passed away in 1891, silly ams caught the attention of other breeders, including Fred Lewis, who played a key role in promoting them. This led to their appearance at dog shows in 1903, culminating in the establishment of the silly am terrier club in 1908, and formal recognition from the Kennel Club of the United Kingdom in 1911. Number 20. The news about these adorable little white terriers quickly spread, making them a hit in England. The breed gained official recognition from England's Kennel Club in 1910, becoming a sensation in dog shows during the early 1900s. Following this, the American Kennel Club acknowledged them in 1911, leading to the establishment of the American Celiam Terrier Club in 1913, marking the breed's rise in the United States. Number 21. The CVM Terrier, once popular, has seen a decline in recent years. By 2008, only 43 CV puppies were registered, making it one of the UK's most endangered native breeds. This decline is believed to have been influenced by tail docking restrictions affecting their role as working dogs, along with the rise of designer breeds and the increasing favoritism towards newer breeds like the Shih Tzu. Number 22. In October 2021, Country Life, a British magazine, initiated a campaign aiming to rescue the endangered Silly Am Terrier breed, drawing attention to its plight. The founder of the Working Silly Am Terrier Club emphasized the importance of annually breeding 300 to 500 puppies to ensure the breed's continued vitality. Number 23. Once a well-known Welsh breed and highly favored among terriers, the Silly has become a rarity today. In the AKC's 2022 list of most popular dog breeds ranked by nationwide registrations, the Sealy M Terrier secured the 164th spot out of 199 total registered breeds. Number 24. If you're looking for a Sealy M Terrier pup from a reputable breeder in the United States, expect prices ranging from $800 to $2,500 or even higher. Keep in mind that factors such as demand, location, and the individual traits of the puppy can influence the cost. Number 25. Despite the declining Celiam Terrier population, certain individuals within the breed have achieved recognition and acclaim in various talk shows. One Celie named Charmin secured the prestigious Best in Show title at Crufts in 2009 and excelled in many other competitive events. Number 26. The Celiam has also been a trendy pick as a pet among the Hollywood elite. Renowned figures in the film industry such as actors Tulula Bankhead, Cary Grant, Humphrey Bogart, Bette Davis, Elizabeth Taylor, and writer Agatha Christie were among the breed's proud owners. Number 27. The British royal family held a strong fondness for silly am terriers. King George V cherished a silly named Jack, and there were specific instructions at Clarence House and Windsor Castle to bring Princess Margaret's two silly ams, Pippin and Johnny, along with her breakfast tray during her breakfast in bed, as reported by a UK Sunday newspaper in 1959. The Queen Mother even looked after the dogs when Princess Margaret was unwell. Number 28. These terriers have left their mark on the silver screen as well. Sealies have a memorable cameo in Alfred Hitchcock's renowned film, The Birds. Hitchcock's two silly ams briefly appear in the movie's opening scenes, exiting a pet shop with their owner. Alright guys, now which of these silly am facts surprised you the most? Please let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.